What's up guys, today I'm going to be showing you my top 5 notification center tweaks. Let's get right into it. So let's start off quickly right here. First I'm going to go over my first application or tweak it is called SB settings and many of you have probably heard about this and many of you have probably not actually used it. So SB settings lets you toggle between your airplane mode, Bluetooth, brightness, data, location, process system, Wi-Fi, and many more things. So for example, if I wanted to change my brightness, I could just click this button and I could put my brightness down or up. And this is really convenient because I don't have to switch out into my settings applications to do this. And if I scroll over to the left, I'm going to have more options such as respringing my device, powering it off, bring in the drop down window with all the actual SB settings settings. And I'll be able to click more and they'll also do the same thing and I could refresh my device. So that is pretty cool. And then now let's go over the next actual tweak I'm going to be talking about. This is called the calendar widget and this is really nice to have on your device. It isn't really a cool tweak but it's a basic calendar that you can just flip to your notification center to and look at the date or an upcoming date if you need it. And the next thing I'm going to be talking about is the RSS widget. You're going to be able to put your own RSS feeds in here. So if you wanted news on say a tech blog or CNN or just about any website, all blogs and websites nowadays mostly have RSS feeds. So you're going to be able to type a URL in the settings and you're going to be able to get the news from the website. And I'll go over the settings and, um, in a second after I go over all this. So for example, if I click on here, I'll be brought to the latest news. It'll take a second to load, so I'll just let it do that. Should be popping up, there it goes. And it will go right over to the CNN.com website. Here it goes, and it brings me the news on here. So that's pretty cool, I can get the latest news right from my notification center. And then right below it, it is something called We Search, and I could type whatever search term I want to in here. The only downside is that if it's down below, when you click on it, this is going to cover up what you're typing in, so you're not going to have to, you're not going to know what you're typing in. You may get something wrong, so that's just something they should be looking to fix. So if I click search, it's going to actually go to Google and search. And if you notice, I can also toggle between YouTube, Wikipedia, and Dictionary. So this is one of my favorites down here. It's called NC Twitter. And I don't use it too much, but I use it whenever I tweet, really. And I can just click on it and then watch this. It should bring up a Twitter interface right here. And I could tweet whatever I want. So if I type in testing or something like that, I could actually click send and watch. You hear that little tweet sound and it lets you know it tweeted and it is it does work with the official Twitter integration so as long as you have your Twitter integrated it will actually send a tweet. So now that is all the top five applications or should I say tweaks that I want to show you. There is a lot more that I actually enjoy but those are just five that I felt like I should show you and the top five I use nowadays. So if we go down into the settings, I'm going to show you something. If we go into RSS widget, this is where you're actually going to enter your feed URL, which you can get from the website. All websites, news websites, they usually give you a feed URL. You just have to type it in right there, and you'll get your latest news. And then that is all for the settings right here. The rest of them, you could actually just go into notifications after you download it. And say you want to activate something like this in your notification center, you have to swipe it on and it will activate it. And basically you see ANSI Twitter, Research, RSS widget, I have to enable them all right in here. Thank you guys for watching. Now I would like to know your guys' top five notification center tweaks. Leave them in the comments below. And if you want any more information as with price or anything like that, there will be a post in the description below where I'll give you all that kind of info. Anyways, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one.